Good morning, LHS. Today is March the 29th, 2019. My name's Mason Destry, and this is Gail's Rap. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Do you know the reason I stopped you today? You caught the smell of these donuts. Have a good day. Krispy Kreme donuts will be pre-sold by the dozen for $8 during lunch periods from the 1st until the 10th. Donuts will be ready on the 12th and they'll be given to you by your first period teacher. All proceeds are gonna be going towards pool punch cards for LCS students. So please buy some. The students in Mrs. Begley and Mrs. Means senior English classes are learning how to prepare for the real world by making resumes, balancing checks, books, and writing checks, and writing formal thank you letters. We had a chance to check it out. Yes, so in my English 12 class, we are currently writing resumes. We are doing formal thank you letters, and we are filling out blank envelopes as if we are sending the letters. Um, we are also doing sample checks, blank checks, um, deposit slips, and we are uh, balancing our checkbooks as if we have a checkbook. Uh, this is necessary because it applies to a whole bunch of real skills that they are going to be using very soon since they are graduating. Most of my seniors are 17 or 18, a couple of them are 19, so they kind of have the drill down of um, knowing what checks are, how to use them, and it's just a really important life skill to have. I hope that uh, a lot of my senior classes find this useful and hopefully they can bring this with them. Um, I know that I was like 21, 22 years old and I was still asking mom and dad how to uh, fill out a check. So I hope that they're not me and they don't do that. <laughs> Congratulations to all the LHS students for competing in the DECA State Championship. Hi, my name is Thalia Perez. I'm a 12th grader. I've been in the marketing education program for two years now. Um, we compete in what's called DECA. DECA is a business competition that the marketing students are allowed to be involved in. We pick an event that has up to 50 people and we compete. Um, some of us made it to states and I'm one of the finalists who got into top 10 in my event out of 50 people. My name is Brianna Hollett. I am a junior in this high school. Um, I made top 10 in the DECA states finalists. I'm Chloe Cosgrove. I'm a junior. I got top 10 in the state. Um, my favorite part of the weekend was just bonding with everyone in the class. We hung out in the, ho the hotel rooms most of the weekend and just hung out and had fun. We got to know everyone super well. I'm Casey. I'm a junior. This is Brendan. <laughs> yeah, uh, my name is Brendan. Uh, I'm a junior as well. Um, we're kind of different from, aside from everybody else. We're actually on a team event, which is very rare, I guess, in Lancaster High School, as Mrs. B always says. So for team events, we actually get more time to prepare and we get uh, extra time with the judges. 
but with team events it's kind of harder because when it's one person you can explain all the things that you want but when it's a team you got to agree on everything and you got to say the same exact stuff to lead up to what you want to accomplish again yeah <laughs> it's really fun we got to hang out downtown in the short north um, go shopping a little bit get rolled ice cream get jenny's and then we ended the night at buca de beppo it's really fun on Thursday, April 4th, the first ever Fairfield County Career Expo will be held at the Fairfield Career Center from 4 to 7.30, with over 30 area businesses planning on attending. The expo is taking place uh, next Thursday, April 4th, from 4 to 7.30. And it is an open invitation to all Lancaster High School juniors and seniors, along with their parents. And at this point, we have over 40 employers from the Fairfield County area that are in the market for employees. And these employers are willing to pay young graduates, graduates from high school, uh, good money. The, the least pay that we have seen from potential employers uh, is $12 an hour. So the students who are not going the college pathway, not going into the military, and who are looking to find a job, uh, a career type of job right out of high school, should really strongly make an effort to get to the Career Expo. Uh, and it's at Fairfield Career Center, which is at the intersection of Coon Path and 33. Uh, so if a student isn't sure where that is, they could just Google that. Be sure to bring in those pennies for movie day, which is on the 16th. Some of the movies include The Greatest Showman and Into the Spider-Verse. Finally, now I can keep these pennies to myself. What the? I smell pennies! <laughs> Oh. Hey man, it's great you're uh, supporting the Lancaster softball team. Yeah, dude, they got uh, home games next week, Wednesday and Saturday. You should come. Huh, I'll be there. Uh -huh. That's all we have for you this week, LHS. And don't forget to come see Mamma Mia the 4th, 5th, and 6th of April. And also, remember, the tickets are $13 for students and $15 for adults. I hope to see you there.